Hey everybody, hello! Happy almost St. Patrick's Day, yay! And happy Friday! Oh, I'm so glad it's Friday. I thought today was Saturday when I woke up. Listen to this, I set my alarm really early because I started taking that thyroid medicine medication today and I don't, my instructions say I have to take and take it an hour before I eat or drink anything, like no coffee or food or anything like that. So I set it really early to take the pill with my plan to go back to sleep for about an hour and a half or whatever, and then get up and get ready and eat something and drink some coffee and go to work. But I forgot to turn my alarm back on. <laughs> it's not funny at all because I woke up at 8.15 and so yeah threw on the trusty wig and this the hat that I've already had to wear one the hat of shame which means I overslept and I've already worn that once this week my boss was not happy and um yeah I don't blame her for not being happy but that has got to stop this is why I need a man in my bed I need a man in my bed to push me out of bed in the morning when the alarm goes off and go, get up. All right. Oh, guess what I have? A Timu haul. Now, this is my last one for a while. I don't know when another one is coming. I mean, there's one that's stuck at an airport somewhere, and I'm supposed to do a, um, I'm doing a collab with Gigi's Craft Addict and Hauls. Gigi's Craft Attic and Halls, and we're doing a mystery swap. So she has my package, so I should be getting hers any day now. So that's coming up, but I don't know where my other team packages are. Let me pose for a, wait a minute, not that side. Let me pose for a thumbnail, just in case something, we don't have any more thumbnails. Cheese, this is my big, it's my big Timu all. Ah. Is my face blowing up yet like a balloon? Let's see. I can't tell. I'm waiting for that balloon face. Every time I take that levothyroxine, my face gets really blown up right here. It looks freaky. And... I'm just going to go in the doctor like that the next time it happens and go, this is why I can't take that medication, sir. Okay, anyway, hi, welcome to my team, all. I hope you're having a good day. How was your day? Um, My day is over. My work day is over. So, yay. What I'm trying to get in this bag is there is a bag within a bag. They double bagged it, which is good nice of them but oh no my nail not only came off but it fell down in there somewhere oh no should i start this over how am i ever going to find it we'll find it eventually i guess until then sad all right, the re this really isn't as big of a Timu haul as it looks. It just has some big, it's only one order. And I will try to place the link to my order in the description box below. Sometimes it doesn't let me. It just posts Timu.com, which doesn't help anybody. But I'll give it a shot. But for now, let's see what's in here. It's another rug. What is my deal with rugs? Rugs, blankets, throw pillowcases. No more aliens, really, unless I see something out, you know, just astounding. Okay, I'm trying to get this out without losing any more fingernails. I cannot believe that just happened. I don't know if I can get this out. I don't. It won't come out. It won't. Ugh. Is it taped to the bottom or something? Okay, get ready for a big pull. No? Okay, forget this thing then. We'll just take something else out of here. Let me try one more time. I don't know if it's glued to the bottom of this bag or what in the world is going on down 
I think it is actually taped to the bottom of this bag. Well, I have an idea. I could open this here. Ridiculous way to live, but sure. I mean, oh, just oh, there. Now that was so easy. See how occasionally it'll take, I mean, it'll take me a little while, but I'll figure out a smart solution to a problem. Wow, that is annoying. Okay, this rug is exhausting me because it's taped all the way around. So now I've got to figure out what I just did with my scissors and cut through this tape. Oh my gosh, what a production. I feel like I should start this video over, but we'll just leave it like this. Um, a construction worker called me baby today. Was that yesterday? It all blends into one day, but he ran and got the door for me and he held it open and went, here you go, baby. <laughs> and I liked it. I'm not complaining. Okay, this rug is, these are the paws. This is upside down. This is a tail. Okay, I'm trying to just walk you through it here. This is a dragon. This is going to look cute in my bathroom too. This is a dragon's head or a lion or a Chinese lion. I don't know, you guys. Whatever it is, you know, it's it's a Chinese animal, either a dragon. Yeah, I think it's a dragon. Look at the horns. And here is its body. And here are its feet down here. And there is the tail. And yeah, I, I got a rug. I don't know. I guess I'm just feeling insecure about having a shortage of bathroom rugs. So I just keep buying them. Or I could put this on my floor in here or let's see, luminate. Wait, I can't read that. Luxurious pink rug, 23.62 times 47. I don't know. I paid $13 and eight cents for it. And it's now $13.59, or I don't know, you guys. Yeah, I got the smallest size, and it's now $13.59, and it is, I, I don't know what it's, I mean, here's what it looks like in all its glory. So, sure. Okay, rug. All right, we got that. Where am I going to put I got an idea. It's a rug. I'm just going to throw it on the floor right now. There goes my very professional studio light. So speaking of, the next big thing in this package, oh Lord, it's just all going to hell in a handbasket. Am I recording? Okay. Is it going to fall over again? Don't. I like talking to inanimate objects. Don't. All right. The next thing in here, I'm probably going to have to cut this out of the bag. You know, these are my favorite. These are my favorite things to light YouTube videos with in my vast, vast experience, which is what I'm using now, but it looks like the box broke open so that Here's a tripod. Here's the rest of the box. All right. And I can't show you what the fill light looks like because there are stickers all over this side. And then there's a box with the tripod taped to this side. Okay, this is so, this is off to a horrible, horrible, horrible start. Let's cut it so I can at least show you the how big. So the light is this big. Just cut this off. Useless. Okay, all right, there. Now. The, so the light is literally this big, and it's on a tripod right behind my monitor right now. 
and I feel it's better than a ring light. It lights up a room. And I just like to have a backup. But I hope the rest of the parts of it are in my bag somewhere. I don't know. They really, the packing of this thing, I don't know. But anyway, yeah, I like to have a backup in case something happens to this one. as Because they're good. They just, they last a few months, like six months or so. And then they kind of get a little wobbly like this one is behind me. And they start falling down. And they're just kind of, just forget it. It's the weekend. I'm going to clean all this stuff up this weekend anyway. I'm going to reach down here and see if I feel my finger, my thumbnail, my thumb nail not thumbnail picture but my actual thumbnail that fell off into this bag into the depths of this bag i can't find it yet okay well that's fine okay the next thing in here oh wait a minute what did i pay for that fill light i paid why did i turn off my phone so that fill light is um 15 $15.98 and that's a 10 inch light and it's still $15.98 and I just keep buying it and buying it and buying it and I like it. I think I've had about four or five. Okay, obviously everything is slanted a little bit. Look at my nose turning red. I'm getting flustered. Oh no, everything's shaking. Okay, where are my scissors now? This is awful. This has got to go down in history as the most technically challenged video I've had. Oh, okay. I saw favorites with Laura haul this, but I had already ordered it, so I'm not copying her. We're a little bit crooked. I don't know how to fix that there. Percy's in the background. <laughs> this is press for champagne, and it does work you just have to put batteries in it does it by any chance have batteries in it were they nice no of course not put those little batteries in it you press this button it goes ding and i want to put it on my wall um not to copy favorites with laura because i know she's got hers in her background too but what I might do is get rid of this bear because it's kind of weird anyway and put press for champagne right there. It looks fancy. And you can get one that's just for decor or you can get one that actually works like this one does. And I'm sorry I have no batteries. And what does this little button do back here? Huh. I guess it's the button mechanism and it's all, I don't know. There's a button back here that you can press too. I have no idea. I'm sure I'll figure it out though. Maybe favorites with Laura will tell me. Maybe it's nothing. Unique and functional vintage front doorbell, 527, wall hanging decor, um, battery operated. Whoa. Whoa. Functional doorbell. It is now thirteen fifty seven. Or if you just want to get the one that doesn't work, eleven eighty seven. I must have gotten mine on one of those spin the wheel, those little square things where the light goes around and around on the square, and then it always ends on like seventy percent. Oh, well, it came with batteries. It always ends on seventy percent off. I'm pretty sure that's what happened in my case. Or sometimes even 90% off. Or lately, 99.9% .9 off. Which is when you get these penny things. I got two two more things for a penny in an order that I placed today. And I was like, getting stuff for a penny. That's my kind of Timu right there. Take off these so they don't, the glare doesn't blind you. Okay, we can check this doorbell now. Check this one here for me and my DJ. Okay, let me get it open. And let's put the let's put the batteries in. I'm so excited. 
Okay. Put them in the right way. Don't let the excitement get the best of the battery functioning. Luna, get out of the garbage. And Luna gets in my garbage. And all right, ready? How do you stop it? Oh, that scared him. I'm sorry that scared you. What does this do? Oh, this is a speaker, you guys, I think. I don't know. Okay, where's my champagne? Oh, yeah, it's coming out of this. All right, that's exciting. All right, that was an exciting sound. And that both of the cats are totally flipping out. Oops. Whoops. All right, next in here, oh, St. Patrick's Day, I got my usual weathered shamrock, uh, you know, um, what is this called? A sweatshirt, but it's not. It's like a long sleeve t-shirt. I bought the same necklace that I bought for when I did a mystery exchange with April from Menopause and Madness. I bought her this necklace and then I liked it so much I bought it myself. <laughs> it's got a crystal hanging off these little, I don't know, opaline pieces or opaline or whatever you call them. I have no idea really what the, what it all is, but um, yeah, wearing it for the that you know crystal energy that I didn't really get today. And then I got these sh glitzy shamrock earrings in from Timu. Thanks, Timu. Okay, next we have one, two, three. Holy cow, what was I doing? Three wall hangings? All right, because we don't have any wall hangings here at all. We never haul wall hangings. Okay, the first one is really cute. It's a cat. It's a couple of cats, and it's a bunch of cats, and they are all partying it up, sleeping, playing, cleaning that one up there. What? What? What does that one say? expensive new cat toy and it's in the box that's funny it's got a sense of humor it's very colorful I like the colors I don't it can go over there on the cat wall I have a wall over there that's got cat pictures on it and like photos of my cats and um this one of these things that I did actually put in a frame one time. That one time I actually did frame one of these things. Okay, um, which it's the black cat and it says the protector on it. Okay, um, I don't have any garbage. I don't have a garbage bag. That's shocking. Okay, what is the next one? The next one... For some weird reason, when I saw it, if this is the one I think it is, when I saw it, it made me cry. And I think it's because I just want, need somebody to say this to me in person. But it is a guest check. And it just says, what if it all works out? What if it all works out? You know how we're always saying what if to ourselves sometimes all day? And sometimes, usually it's some kind of negative consequence, like... What if I screw up this report or what if I blah, blah, blah. What if once in a while we tried saying, what if it all works out? So I don't know. I was in an emotional mood when I saw it. And so I bought this and I might, yeah, this one, I might get it mounted and I, and take it to work and put it, hang it, um, in my little workspace. And just to reassure myself, really to remind myself to stop saying, what if I screw this up or whatever to myself all day? What if it all works out? It usually does. Okay, so that was $2.97. Okay, I'm sorry. The cat thing that I just showed you, I paid $2.98 for it. And it's still $2.98, but that's the smallest size. And same with what if it all works out. I paid $2.96. Let me look. I paid $2.96 for it, and it's the smallest size, and it's now 
It's actually the only size that one comes in. And then the third one is, these are my favorite, these vintage, these pictures of the vintage ladies that then have words like spray painted over them. I don't know if you've seen these in your Timu feeds, but this one, wait, let me look at my glasses so I can see what is this set of two vintage girl canvas prints, 648. And I don't know. I just like them. I have one hanging up. I, I did hang up another one. I have one hanging up across from me that says, sorry, not sorry. She's all gussied up, but then spray painted over it. It says, sorry, not sorry. These two, I don't know. I just like them. I don't know why they didn't really mm. get, let me get the plastic off. Okay, so the first one is just, she's kissing the mirror and it says mirror, mirror on the wall. I don't know. This one was, this one is fine. I don't know. It's what, this one is whatever. The one that made me laugh was the one that says, this would look cute in my bathroom, actually. I'm going to hang this one in my bathroom. And then this one, says, why be basic when you can be extra? And she really is extra. Look at all the jewels she's got hanging off of her. All the way down here. And she, all this. She got her fan. And wow, I wish I lived back then. Wouldn't it be fun to dress like that? It would take forever to get dressed in the mornings. But wow, she's got those beautiful pearls in her hair. I don't know. First of all, I thought she was beautiful. And then why be basic when you can be extra? Extra. Um, the set of those two were five, they're, it, the set of those two was 528, and I think, I don't know what size I got, I think that's the smallest size, I don't think I got the gigantic size, let me look, two sizes, I don't know what size I got, I got the 40 by... 60, 15 by two. Let me see. I'm curious to see what size I got. Oh, I got the largest size. Okay. The largest size, 648 for the set of two, but I paid and I paid 648 for the set of two. Okay. The next thing in here is a box. Where's my fingernail? Can I find it now? Come on, we know it's in. Oh, I found it. Where's my fingernail glue? I'm gluing it. Yeah, we're taking a fingernail glue break. I'm gluing my fingernail back on. I wonder which one of these many pockets of this purse I put it in. I think I put it, there it is. There it is. It's all dirty. It's got stuff stuck to it. Brush on candy, Moyo, brush on nail glue is what it, wow, my nails look bad underneath these press on nails. Will they ever look crazy Mimi Yup offered to send me this. She emailed me and asked me if she could send me this UV gel lamp with some nails that go with it and stuff and I was like I don't know if I'll be messing with my nail she said you know for Japan and I don't know if I'll be messing with my nails in Japan can you see me like stopping a whole tour group and going hold on a minute I gotta glue a nail back on or whatever and I don't know how to use gel I don't know I, sh I should learn how to do gel nails huh would those be falling? Oh, we feel so much better now. The collective we. The royal we. Not me and all the voices in my head. Okay, here's a box. 
look at all these little tubes. I can't wait to just lie down in the middle of all this stuff and take a nap in a minute. It's fairly early here. It's only like um, 5.30. I, I got on, I got done. I got off work and I got on it. Got on it. I said, for once in my life, I'm going to upload a Timu haul video before 9 o'clock or whatever. Okay, this is... I have no idea what this is. It. Oh my gosh, whatever it is, it looks like it's a do-it-yourself something. Now look... Oh, my word. Okay, what? What is it? I don't want to look at the picture first. I don't want, I don't want to spoil the surprise. Okay, whatever this is, there's that. There's what looks like a stand with a USB cord. And then in here... Honestly, I don't, I have no idea what this is. This is, oh, okay. I bought a little lamp. <laughs> I don't know why. It's a little, there's a scuba diver in there with some sea turtles and some, and so you put it in this stand and then there's a light in the stand. Okay, let's see if we can't get it. <gasps> It's real, um, I don't know what it is made out of. This must be just a little wipe to clean it off, to all the fingerprints or thumbprints. But let's plug in the, let's plug this in if I can. And Okay, so the base is lit up. It does have an on. Don't be like that. Hold on, I can't. It does have an on and off switch. Off, on, okay. Yes, it's got an on and off switch. Okay, so here's the lit base. And then you put the thing in there and it doesn't really do <laughs> maybe because the lights it's too light in here for us to really see any super dramatic results okay ah there goes my light okay there I mean okay that's nice I guess sure it's different it can go on my desk downstairs. Now, I have a desk downstairs. Ooh, be careful of it. I think I'm going to wrap it back up in its bubble tape before. I don't want it to crack. Wait, let me get my light back. What a mess. What a chaotic mess. Okay, hold on. Let me wrap this back up in here. And then let me entertain you. Okay, let me get this light back up here where it belongs. Pull it. I'm just going to have to hold it with my feet because it's not standing up now. This light is on its last leg, kind of like literally. All right, don't. <laughs> and yelling at it doesn't help like at all. But you know, it does help. Like I wrap this thing around it to keep it in place. Sorry for this really close up view of my face. Okay, all right. Let me unplug this. Put this back in the little box. Put this back in this little box. All right, that's really nifty. What in the world did I pay for that? I like the little scuba diver that was in that thing. Okay, um, hello? Okay, let me get... Everything is so screwed up. I feel confused and lost. That was... $8.09, and it's a resin. It's made out of resin. 
handmade home decor bedside lamp. Well, I mean, I wouldn't call it a bedside lamp, but okay. And um, $23.59 is what it costs now. And I got it for $8.09. So that must have been another one of those deals, like 90% off deals. And see, I can't, I'm like the perfect sucker for those things because I cannot resist buying Ooh, I can get it cheap. Look how cheap I can get this. Do I need it? No. So I'm the total perfect sucker. Now, why I thought I needed these, I don't know. They fascinated me. 12 pieces of random style transparent capsules with people inside for do-it-yourself jewelry. Now, look at this. They are, what if you swallowed this one morning for the heck of it? Now, my hand is still all cut up. I don't know why. They're capsules. Let me try this hand, although I cut my thumb today. I'm just a mess. They're little capsules with little people in there. Like, what if you just swallowed this like a vitamin? Would it come out all right in the end? Would it all work out in the end? Or would you end up in the emergency room? Here's another one with a little... <laughs> the, like when I was a kid, we had these little jumping beans. Not the ones, oh, not the ones with the little moths inside of them, but like the plastic capsules that were painted with faces on them. And I really loved, she looks like she's ready for some street walking. Just the way she's standing like that. Or is that a guy? I don't know. Anyway, there are 20, no, there are 12 of these little capsules with people inside. And it's got to be, I go down in history, is like one of the weirdest WTF things I bought on Timu. Now, this thing says use for pendants or earrings or whatever. So, yeah, I mean, I guess if you made jewelry and you wanted to hang little Someone would have to get really close to you, though, to see a little person in your ear. I got glue all over my thumb. All right. Anyway, what am I going to do with those? I shove them in a junk drawer, probably. I don't, I don't know. If you have any ideas of what I should do with my 12 little... Oh, wait. What I'm curious to know is, can we open the capsules? Can they be opened? Here's one. Let's take a look at it first before. Is that a hula girl? I can't even tell what's going on. Oh, it's upside down. Looks like a guy sitting down. All right, can they be opened? No. Uh-oh. Yes. Wow, I mean, let me get my glasses. And I need a magnifying glass. Here's the little dude. Um, is that Bernie Sanders? <laughs> I don't know. But anyway, okay, yes, you can open them. I I wouldn't advise it. They're too small even for like anybody to play with. Not and you wouldn't want to give these to a little kid. Oh my gosh, they'd get swallowed so fast if you gave this to a little kid. Or even just a prankster kid who wanted to do this for like a TikTok challenge. Let's see how many people we can swallow. <laughs> Let's see how many people. I paid a dollar fifty. No, they're they're a dollar fifty two. Yeah, and that's what I paid for those twelve of them. Is that all? There's also, unfortunately for me, an Apple watch band, and I don't have an Apple watch. I thought this would fit my smartwatch but no it's made for 
eye watches. It's got hello, it's rose gold and it's got Hello Kitty charms hanging down from it. It's really pretty and I'm really bummed that it doesn't fit my watch. And I figured it out like when I was looking at this order today going, oh, and that is $6.48 is what I paid for it. And I think, you guys, that that, oh, hold on a minute. My scissors just stabbed me. I think that's it. And yeah, here's that plastic thing that that rug was in. It's totally taped to the bottom of the bag. All right, so wow, 35 minutes, a 35 minute haul. That's like a short haul that I've done. I'm like, I'm not used to doing hauls this short. And it had so much promise, didn't it? With a huge bag like that. Maybe, oh, and I didn't take any thumbnails. Well, there really wasn't anything to take a thumbnail with. I mean, we can take Press Bell for Champagne cheese. I don't know. Press for champagne. Okay, maybe we'll do that one. Maybe we'll do that one. Or maybe I'll just do that one that I took. Oh no! <laughs> it broke off again. Or maybe I'll just do that one. It didn't break off again. I just didn't put enough glue on it the first time. So yeah, I mean, it did pop off again because I didn't glue it down enough. I got glue all over my finger. I just didn't get it on my nail. Do I have anything else I'd like to talk about while I have your attention? I don't even know where the nail glue is now. Oh no, why can't I put things back where I got them? I might have to watch the video to find out where I put my nail glue. Hmm. Um, I don't, nothing exciting happened today. I mean, I just went to work really, really, really late and did my work. And I guess I'll pull this off again until I find that glue weird anyway i don't yeah i have no funny stories i have no gossip i have no nothing just got up really late slept through my alarm went to work kind of got in trouble for that a little bit and came home here i am and just reminded me that yes i need a man to kick me out of bed in the morning. Well, if I had a mat, now look. If I was, if I were seeing someone, I would not bring him here. Like, I wouldn't have him sleep in here with my mom downstairs. Oh, I couldn't do that. Anyway, whatever. All right, that's me and my thoughts on if I had a man. No, well, no, he would not be sleeping in my bed, even if my bed were pristine with no stuffed animals all over it and looked like an adult's bed but my mom is right downstairs and that is awkward all right everybody there we go just let, but let's just get that whole vision out of our heads we don't like to think like that don't think that into existence okay i love and appreciate you guys so much thank you for watching sorry this video was a little weird but I hope that you are having a great night or afternoon or morning or whatever it is when you watch this. And I will talk to you soon. Maybe tomorrow I'll finally, I'm not going to dangle that in front of you. I was going to say maybe tomorrow I'll finally do a try on haul. But every time I say that, then I don't and people get mad. But I'll figure, I'll try to figure something out this weekend. All right, everybody. Um, don't forget to click a thumb, please, up or down, just for please for my sake, because I'm in the doghouse with YouTube who doesn't believe my watch, my, my view counts are real, so they need thumbs to back up the views, so please hit a thumb 
I don't care which one it is. And then thank you for your kind comments down below. And thank you for checking to make sure you're still subscribed. And if you're new here, I'm sorry this video was a mess. But feel free to stick around. Sometimes we have a lot of fun. Okay, now Darth Vader kiss. And now I say, how do I stop this thing? How do I 